Hey guys, I'm Nick, aka the one and only Nick's Games. Today, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to install shaders in Minecraft 1.8. First off, I do want to say you need to go to this link, Minecraft 4.0 and SF4, because it doesn't matter. It's the first link in the description down below. Go down there, click that, it will take you to this page, where on this page, there's a few things we need to talk about and a few warnings you need to know before you uh, download this. This requires a very good graphics card. Very good. NVIDIA or AMD graphics card. If you do not have that, don't even try to install this mod. It will not work. It will crash. It will do all kinds of things to your PC. If you have a good NVIDIA or AMD graphics card, then proceed forward from here. If not, then, you know, you're, you're kind of out of luck. I'm, I'm sorry, but there's nothing literally I can do except tell you to get a better graphics card in your PC. That's pretty much it. Anyway, if you do have a good NVIDIA graphics card or a good AMD graphics card, as do I, a great NVIDIA graphics card, we can proceed forward. For Minecraft 1.8, as you can see here, is the download alpha version. Click that. It actually takes us off to a form post, right? Because this is actually in beta. In the latter versions of this, when it is not in uh, in alpha here, you'll be able to come down here and click on download page one or download page two to uh, download the mod. Nevertheless, for right now, alpha version takes us off to a form post where we can click download page one and then takes us directly off to add flight where up here we're going to wait five seconds. In that five seconds, I'm going to say this. Right click, reload, if... AdFly doesn't work and you don't see that countdown. If that doesn't work, go and Google in how to enable cookies on your browser. Follow the tutorials there and bada bing bada boom, you're good to go. Nevertheless, skip ad right here. It will then take us off to Dropbox where we can then click download. It will then download the mod, which we do want to keep. So if we minimize here, here it is on our desktop. If it isn't on your desktop, hit the Windows key or keyboard and R at the exact same time. Type in Downloads, hit Enter, it will be right here in your Downloads folder. If it is in your Downloads folder, simply click it and uh, drag it to your desktop just for ease of use. Nevertheless, once it's on your desktop, you want to right-click on it and you want to open with Java Tap Platform Java TM Platform SE Binary. Sorry guys, it's like the seventh video I've recorded in a row. Click that, it will then open up this, where we then want to click yes. Okay, I agree, and okay. Bada bing, bada boom, it is now installed and we can delete this. We then want to go into Minecraft and open the Minecraft Launcher. Right, once we're in the Minecraft Launcher, we want to go to the profile we want to play right down here. In my case, that's Nick's Games. Hit Edit Profile. And then we want to find it right here, release 1.8-shaders. You were just probably release 1.8 or release 1.8.1. That's not what we want. We want release 1.8-shaders. Click that, click Save Profile, and click Play. It is now going to launch Minecraft 1.8 with shaders installed. Now, the key issue here is shaders packs. Currently, they basically don't work in Minecraft 1.8. There's some big, big warnings about that. Uh, you know, the, the developer has been freaking out about shaders packs not working. He said he is working on it, but uh, it's kind of an issue. So if we go up here right now, as you can see, pretty much nothing done here um, to make it look any better. A little bit of shading over there and stuff, but nothing made her. The reason for that is if we go into shaders right here, there is no shaders packs installed minus internal. I'm going to turn this on. It might crash. External ones basically will crash, guys. Click done, and uh, that'll give us a little bit of some shading, as you can see, but it's very, very poor. And the reason for that is because shaders is honestly in beta right now. However, as time goes on, we'll be able to see it come out of beta, and you'll be able to uh, to do more things and install custom shaders packs. Well, Nick, how do I install custom shaders packs? It's very, very easy. Simply go into Options, Shaders Pack, and click Open Shaders Packs Folder. Then the shaders packs you download, you just simply take and drag them into this folder. So, um, so yeah, as you can see, very, very buggy here, and uh, I am now zoomed in forever. So let's go ahead and see if we can save and quit to time. No, it's not going to let me do that. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. Kind of a fail on Shader's part there, but like I said, it is in beta. This is Shader's. It will update over time. And uh, what you really need to look for is when you go to the Minecraft form post here, make sure that it's not alpha version. Make sure it's beta version or final release version like these are. Once you've found that, you're good to go, right? It's going to work perfectly. Stuff like this isn't going to happen. I'm going to have to uh, to hard quit out of Minecraft 
to get that fixed. But anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. That's how you use Star Shaders in Minecraft 1.8. That's going to work no matter when you download it. I would recommend probably waiting off a little while before you download it, but I've been asked so many times to show me how to install shaders, Nick, that I thought I would finally give in. I usually don't do videos on alpha versions unless they're at least somewhat stable. Shaders is pretty far from it, but so many people have been asking. I thought I might as well give you guys what you want. So here you go. That's how to install shaders in Minecraft 1.8. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give a thumbs up. It really does help me out. I'm Nick's Game. Subscribe to this channel if you haven't already for awesome Minecraft tutorials every single day of the week. I am out, guys. Peace. And there's some videos you guys probably want to go check out. On the left is how to install Forge in Minecraft 1.8. That video shows you, well, exactly how to get Forge in Minecraft 1.8. Go check it out. And on the right is how to install Optifine in Minecraft 1.8.1. Yes, Optifine is updated already to Minecraft 1.8.1. And that video shows you exactly how to install it. And also, check out the video in the bottom center of your screen. It's actually a group of videos, a channel, some may say, that will show you exactly how you can grow your YouTube channel. So, why not go check it out? Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. I'm Nick's Games, and I I'm out. Peace.